Kids, I want to invite you to come on up here. It's been like a year and a half since we've done this. Come on up and have a seat right in front of me. And Junia has the box. And we are going to pull. Now, some of you aren't used to this. So, Victor, come on up. Bring your brother up here. We're going to sit right here. No, Junia, come back. Come back. Whoa, whoa. Come back here, girlfriend. Have a seat. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull something out of this box. And we're going to do a little object lessons. Hopefully something that points us to Jesus and the truth of the Bible. And I, This is heavy, Junia. What did you put in here? Did you put dirt in here? I can't, oh my goodness, I'm shaking and I can't even figure out what it is. And it is, you did it. You are the second person in 25 years to put in GAC. Look at this. Excuse me while I blow my nose. <laughs> What am I going to, oh my, look at all of it. I mean, you guys have just got to see this. This is crazy. All right. Yeah. Oh my, yeah, it's getting all over my hands. I've got it on the carpet. Uh, oh, what am I going to do? That's you. That's you. Oh, excuse me while I uh, sneeze. That's you. All right. All right. Okay. So. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, man, it's in my hair. I'm like, oh, man, this is... I'm going to need a Kleenex or something. Clean up on aisle, Pastor One. All right, here we go. So, this stuff reminds me of in the Bible. You ready for this? In the very book of Genesis, it's, you can put, it says that the Spirit hovered over the waters... And there was disarray, and there was no form or void. It was just kind of like, you can't put this in, it, the form only goes in what it is, but if you just let it by itself, it would just ooze all over the place. And so, there are many people who don't think that God created the world, Shh. that God created the world, so they say, the world started from primordial ooze. And then, just out of chance, by happenstance, a single-celled organism emerged from this. And that it, and it eventually led to, I don't know, a lizard. No, it had to be a sea creature, because then they say, oh, the sea creature decided to learn how to walk and became a, a, a lizard, and then the lizard turned into a rhinoceros, and uh, just crazy stuff. Let me tell you something. Chance didn't create anything. God created it. And he took this stuff and from it, he in his word said stuff like, let there be light, let there be lizards, let there be birds, let there be fish, let there be, I don't know, tigers. And he said it was good. And God created stuff. And then he created Adam. And from Adam and Eve. And he didn't just say that men or women are good. He said they're what? Very good. You're the pinnacle. You're the highest point of creation. Because you were created in the image of God. Rhinoceroses do not bear the image of God. Neither do nematodes. Dragonflies are pretty, but they don't reflect the image of God. Because you can tell the truth. You can be forgiving. You can love. You can be honest and kind and gracious. And that's how we reflect the image of God. So thank you for this stuff. I've got some on the...